The murder of Vicky Lee was taking place at Dream High School. Bobby Lore was accused of being the murderer of Vicky Lee but was not held guilty due to the lack of evidence. The parents of Vicky Lee seek for revenge and invaded Dream High School. As you can tell, Bobby Lore was murdered by her parents in 2012, February 29th. But before the death of Bobby, he cursed the family of Vicky. When the day of a coming comes, it will be the day of truth, the day of judgment. Anybody who gets in my way will pay the price. Damn, Vicky. <laughs> Damn. It's a beautiful Mommy, 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 what, huh? Mommy, what, huh? Wake up. No, not too fast. Oh, that's too fast. Stop, slow down. Huh? Who slapped me? Uh. Willie, what are you doing up so early? I have work. Get, get ready for school. Okay, but doesn't work start at 11 a.m.? Here's your lunch. Only bread? Hello, you haven't answered my question. Answer me. I'm not dad who's gonna answer every question for you, all right? The only reason why I made you move in with me because you said you want to be more of an independent person. Well, I'm sorry. Can you just answer me this one time? Questions. Whatever. I just got a call from work from earlier. I just gotta go in. Don't be late for school. What a beautiful day. It's really been this long. Wait, school starts in two hours. Now time! Why is the window open? Well, maybe Wendy opened it. I'll just tell her to close the lid on. No, no, no. It's my stuff. It's gone. Cool. Wow. It's really been four years ever since Ricky passed away, huh? Yeah, but... Don't forget mom and dad also got sentenced to death that year too. Yeah, but don't forget that your big sister Wendy will always have your back. You're right, Wendy. I'll just leave everything in the past and move on. Hey, what's that on your forehead? You did it, huh? I had that. Oh, come out the door. Yeah. Oh yeah, don't come into my room in the middle of the night and open the window. It gets cold, you know? It's cold. Um, yeah, wait, I didn't even go in the room last night. You're silly. <laughs> no one else lives with us. Oh yeah, um, erase that thing in your head, it's cold. Thank you. you gotta go. Why is it so cold? Whoa, 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 what the? Who are you? What are you doing? Are you 
you robbing me? Take anything you want. The uncommon day has come. And all gets my way will pay the price. Oh! Baby, baby, oh baby, I thought you were mine. Hazelnut? Must be looking man. Enjoy the hazelnuts. Don't eat it until 5 p.m. To Mr. Yang. From a friend? Isn't that weird? A friend? I wonder who. Oh my god, it hit me. Five more minutes. Oh my god, I'm late for school. Oh, shoot. Baby, 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 oh, baby, baby, oh, baby. Hey! Why are you late, Gary? You got a good reason. I was, um, I was, um. Uh, um, what, huh? I, I, I woke up late. Sorry, sir. Sorry, sir. Better go get your lunch, kid. Gary, but you won't come to school late again. Get the right back. Hey Gary, are you done with uh, the math homework pages 1, number 4, 12, and 20? Yeah, I'm done with it. Why? Do you need help? No, because I actually know how to do it. Okay, so how does it go then? Okay, well, simple. It goes like this. So it's with a quadratic formula of negative 11 plus or minus square root of 11 squared subtracted by 4 times... Yeah. 4 times 6 negative 35 divided into 2 times 6. First, you do the numbers under the square root. Let's start with the first. Okay, now who teaches you these things? Oh, your fan fix. 11 squared. What's wrong with Lucky? Maybe he likes you. He always looks at you, not us. Maybe you're right, Glenn. I do need a boyfriend after all. <laughs> Dude, do you all just kidding about it? Why would you go with somebody like that? Glenn, I wouldn't mind. Maybe he just really like you. That's why he's always look at you. No, you guys are wrong. Great. Do you remember four years ago your brother was murdered in this school? Yeah. What about it? Ever since the start of this year, look at his back then. Maybe it was it's the curse Bobby said. The curse Bobby said. It was so long ago. I don't recall. The day of the comment will be the day of judgment and the day of truth. Do you remember? Guess what day is it? February 29th. I just noticed your brother died the same day. February 29th. The day of the comment. Come every four years. Wow, I sound so smart. No, I won't accept it. Everything just said is fake. Where's truth? Where is judgment now? Maybe you're right. We shouldn't believe it today. Let's just pretend like nothing happened. No, that's not yet. Nothing is going to happen today. Okay, okay, I don't even go that way anyways. Oh, so one of the two is chasing over here, huh? It's not what it looks like, babe. That's what you say. But you know one's gonna come to the TD club today. Someone will come. I wonder what kind of topics are disgusting about. I bet you're just gonna be something about four years ago. Don't you dare mention about four years ago. And what you gonna do about it? Don't do it, you had no chance. I don't care! I'm just gonna beat his ass! You picked the wrong day to pick a fight. <laughs> I got you back, Gary! I'll see you later, man! Straight up this man. Alright, guys, coming in? 
Come on in. Alrighty. As you guys know, this is the topic discussion class. It doesn't look like there's a lot of people today. But how are you guys doing? Good. That's great. Let's get off to a great start today. Does anybody have any... Oh, what happened to your faces? Oh, uh, I ran into a pole. I guess I ran into a pole too. That's alright. Go on, sit on down. Let's get started. So, does anybody have any topic for us to discuss about today? Does anybody have a topic? Anyone? If no one has a topic to discuss about, I'll give you guys a topic. Okay, it seems like no one has a topic. Let's get started. You guys should know it's a special day today. It's February 29. We're going to talk about the uncommon day. I knew it! I try, I'll try to make it short. So four years ago, Vicky Lee was murdered at this school and this classroom. Yes, I said it. And this classroom, last person seen with Vicky Lee was Bobby Lore. So he was accused and sent off to trial, but was not held guilty because there wasn't enough evidence. As you guys know it, the parents of Vicky Lee was so mentally in pain from the death of their daughter. So they came here to this school to find Bobby Lore. When they found him, they first stabbed him right in the back. Then they shot him four times. One on the shoulder, two in the stomach, and one in his thigh. The parents, fight, the parents fleed but was caught outside by the cops. And everyone knows, rumor has it, before Bobby died, he cursed the family of Vicky and the killer of Vicky. In the end, the murder of Vicky Lee stayed unknown. I'm sorry if I made this story long. I told you guys I was right. Rick, be quiet, the percentage of your little crew right now is zero. Well, the percentage of your face is the square root of my face. Guys, guys, it's okay to flirt, but not in here. What you say? All right, all right. Calm down. Calm down. Tonight, we're lucky to have the younger brother of Bobby, Gary Lore. Also introducing the younger sister of Vicky, Mary Lee. Can both of y'all come up and let's discuss? Let's discuss. Did you think Bobby killed Vicky? No. Gary? Did you think your brother killed Vicky? No. Explain? Um. Oh, look at the airplane! Oh, wait, 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 Oh, oh, my stomach's hurting. Can somebody else come in and lead a discussion, please? Tyson? All right, coming up. Ah. Uh, all right, I gotta head back out. I gotta use Russian. I will see you guys in a bit. So much pressure. My God, I'm sweaty. I gotta change out this clothes. Baby, baby, oh baby, I thought you were mine. Oh. I've been waiting for this all day. Mm. I'm full. I'm a little dizzy. Bobby, are you here? Bobby, are you here? Today is the day of the uncommon. Show yourself. All the students here should be in the TD club. There shouldn't be anybody walking around. What are you doing? Shh. Don't shush me. You're not supposed to be here on these halls. Shh. They'll hear us.
<laughs> he doesn't look like any this anymore. Was he really the one? Yes, he was. Today is the day of truth, the day of judgment. I want you to kill everybody else in this building, and I'll help you too. Who's he talking to? I've been waiting for this day to happen. We'll just do it before it's midnight, and keep little brother Gary safe. I know. They can't get out with these keys. Well, it looks like we got a first two person in line. I'll finish them off for a minute. Oh shoot, he sees us! Let's run! Oh no, it's Bobby! Oh shit. Damn, I just fall asleep. You're a lass? Where did my keys go? From my research, Mary and Bobby are very close friends. Mary, do you know anyone else who's closer to your sister? Well, every time when she's at home, she always mentions about this guy that she likes. Oh, a guy. What did she say about him? Um, she's, she says that she likes him, but she can never be with him because He's with someone else. What did, did she say this to you? No. We used to sleep on the same bunk bed and I overhear it over the phone. But I didn't really pay attention. Interesting. Bob is not that kind of person. He would not do anything like that. Who is gonna be? The staffs? Mr. Tao hasn't come back yet. Something smells fishy here. Hmm. Hey guys, isn't it obvious? Mr. Tao's a killer. He put his own spot, you know? No, Mr. Tao has been single for 20 years. He wouldn't have been a murderer. But Mr. Yang does have a wife. Yo, Mr. Yang, but you get a mustache. You didn't have one. Fuck this. It's fake. I don't know where it's like a little man. You guys still here? We should have shot to Mr. Tao. Mr. Tao went to the bathroom. We're waiting on him. I see. You guys know you guys know him club in this building? You guys know that all the doors on the first floor have been locked? So we're stuck here. The school Wi-Fi isn't working. Have you tried using the school phone to call 911? I tried, but the line's been cut off. Where are your keys? Um, I don't know. I lost them or something. I think something weird is happening. I think the on comments is happening, you guys. Don't say that. You're scaring us. It's alright, guys. I'm not even scared at all. I guess the comment was true. Shut up, Rick. Just wait till Mr. Tal comes back. We'll figure something out. I want to go home. I'm scared. It's okay, guys. If something happened, I'll protect you guys. All right, stay here, kids. I will give Mr. the towel. Get out here. There's an intruder coming. What? What's going on? Mr. Towel. Where are we going? I'm going to die. Calm down. Calm down. Mr. the towel. What's going on? There's no time to sleep. Oh, shit. He's coming. Let's go. Ah. Shit. Oh, Mayor, protect me. You're supposed to be protecting me. It's only a 40 chest, we're going to make it out of here. Good luck, guys. You scared everyone! You can't get in! Wait, I'm not getting in my clothes! I don't want to die this time, Paul. Yeah, sure. Wait. It's now not the time to be talking about this! He doesn't look so tough. Guys, help me, guys! Guys, we should attack him together. Hey, guys. Okay, step out of it. <laughs> ah! Ah! I know why you're here. You want me, don't you? Guys, come to your sisters. You need to get out of here. You can take my life if you want. No! No! Ah! no. Mr. Yang, help me, Mr. Yang. Mr. Yang, help! Oh. Mr. Yang, help! Oh. I don't mean to, please don't kill me. I don't mean to tell anybody. Your last, remember? Thank God.
Did they just really leave me here alone? <laughs> No, don't touch her, only I can touch her! Oh, we're still here? I think we're pretty safe here. We've been running for an hour and now we're here. Do you think the others are okay? I think they're all dead. Mary, I almost lost my chance with you! You almost got killed! Lucky I saved you! What are you talking about? You would never have a chance with me. <laughs> 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 I'm gonna move my chair. Here, you're alive! It's interesting how you get here. Is the others dead? I'm not sure, but while I was running around the school, I found Lucky's dead body in the math classroom. Look what I found! What is that? Well, uh, I found it in the room where Lucky died. It's a flechero. Hey, what? It comes from the original board where people used to communicate with spirits. Guess I just realized something! Tyson, there is a day of the comment. Maybe we should stay until midnight. I know that from the start, stupid. There's a chance he can still find us here, but I have a plan. What is it? We have to find him. We need the keys. I need Rick, Glenn, and Mary to distract him while me and Gary tries to get the keys. Whoa, that's crazy! We have to if, you will, if we want to get out of here. Do you want to die? Yeah, we'll go with it. I'm up for it. Me too. All right, let's head to the math classroom first. Why? Talk to Lucky by using the board, but we'll make it quick. After that, we'll head to the TV room. Why go back there? So we can talk to Lucky about the truth. Don't you guys want to know? Yeah, I do. <clears throat> Same here. Alright, what time is it? It's, uh, it's 10.45 p.m. It's almost 11! Feels like a movie! Let's try before it's midnight, because it's easier to talk to Lucky when it's still uncommon. Well, Mr. Yang, are you okay? I'm so scared! Well, well don't touch me, man! It's not the time to Let's be sad. Be calm. Yeah. I know back in your high school days, you took acne class. And I know you just have to act tough right now. Thank you. Thank you, man. Let's go. Ah! I was just lucky. I was new stinks. Really, Glenn? Really? At this time. Oh, I'm sorry. Lucky all your hair. Lucky all your hair. <gasps> I got some quick questions for you. Who killed you? That man. Um, who are you talking to? Shh, talk to Lucky. Whose boar is this? That man. Who did he summon here? What are you guys looking at? Um, <laughs> uh, Mary, what are you doing? Are you okay? She's faking it! Somebody slap her! Really, Glenn? Really? I'm, I'm, I was just kidding. Maybe we should go help her. Go! 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 What do we do now? I, I, I don't know. M maybe we should... Don't touch her! Ah, don't touch her! Ah, hey, it's okay! Hey, it's okay! It's okay! It's okay! It's okay! It's okay! It's okay! Look up, Gary, wake up. Mm. Not too fast. Step on the brakes. Uh, who slapped me? Hey, Mary, what happened? Are you okay? I said everything. Mary, who's that person? Uh, who's my sister, Wendy? I think she's dead. Probably I'm assuming. At this rate, we have a low chance of getting out of here. Since Bobby can physically harm us. Well, let's head to the TD room. All oh, this very nervous stuff is making me go crazy! Be quiet, you're not helping! So, calm down, Glenn. Let's just go to the TD room. Where's Mr. Yang? He ran out. Just let him go. Well, what about Lucky? Oh, we'll see you, Lucky.
Oh, she's holding my hand. <laughs> Vicky, you're here. Vicky, I know you're here. Show up. I don't think that's how you use it. Don't doubt Tyson. He got this. Vicky, can you come out? I'm your sister Mary. Yo, what's up, guys? Hey, my G. How y'all feeling today, huh? Y'all didn't leave me a chair. What is this? How rude. Is she being a ghost? Let's get to the point. Vicky, we'll kill you. My lover, he would always ask me for something expensive until that one day. I was hanging out with my friends and having a grand time, talking about our usual gossip. Then my so-called boyfriend messaged me, telling me he wanted to see me. Happily, I ran to his side. Although seeing him almost every day, he still makes my heart flutter. He told me he wanted to go to this one place, telling me it was a surprise. He talked about how happy he was being able to see me, Nothing could make me happier than spending time with him. As we were walking, we bumped into the hall staff. I forgot his name, but he was cleaning the windows. I said a quick hello while my quote-unquote boyfriend ignored him. He led me into this one class. I was expecting balloons and flowers, but boy, I was wrong. He wanted my necklace. He kept on insisting on giving him the necklace, but I kept saying no. I don't want him to have it. Then his girlfriend called for him. To shut me up, he grabbed me. Unable to breathe and struggling, he got frustrated, how I couldn't stop screaming. He pulled out his knife and stabbed me. He? Him? We didn't ask you how you died. We asked you who killed you. Tell me! Come down, girl! She tell us! The man that you guys are looking for is coming through that door right now. <clears throat> Rick, how come I said I could be tough now? What are you doing? Why'd you do it? I Do what? Why'd you kill Vicky? I didn't do it! Lies! All lies! And who else? I told her to stay away from him! Show you! Okay, okay stop. Stop. I know who it is. Well, well, well. I guess you caught me. What? Pretty smart. How could it be you, Bobby? I might as well tell you the truth. I've always had the desire for money and fame. But... I've never showed you this side of me. It kind of sucks not to be me at home. If only Mr. Yang here didn't see me take Vicky into this room, I would have never been caught. <laughs> but Vicky's crazy parents came here and killed me. If only Mr. Yang didn't report me. That's why he's the last person I want to kill. Now, who should I choose? Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Where did Bobby go? Looks like we got a fight. Oh, looks like a real movie. Ding, ding! Whoa, whoa! Right hook, left strike. Oh, it didn't work this time. Oh, come on, time! Nasty knockout! Glenn, help Gary! Don't worry, I got this! Yeah, whoa, whoa! Oh, don't worry, I got it this time! Whoa, whoa! I'm gonna use my new technique! Good idea. Dang, y'all can't even handle your own fights. Just kill him already. He doesn't deserve to be last anymore. <laughs> Wake up, boy. Who are you? Why are you trying to kill me? Rick? No, Rick! You borrowed kills me. You don't deserve lift. Louis? How could you? And what? Let's head to the front doors. What about Gary and Rick? I want someone to dead. Wait, wait. Mary, before I die, I I need to tell you something. 
I I have always always love your shoes. Can I have them? Don't say that, Glenn. You're gonna make it out of here. But no, you can't have them. Mary, I'll see you in another life. Tyson, why are you so calm? Because there's only 30 seconds before my night. She's dead. Let's get going. Not yet! <gasps> Glenn! You're alive! What happened to you? I... I don't know. Wait, I remember something. I died. But how am I... Get away from me! I, I know now. He's... He's in here! You really thought it was over, huh? <laughs> Mary. Let's play a game. Glenn or Tyson, choose who to die. Hurry up. I can't choose. Time's up. I do need a fresh body. What the? What's going on? A new body, a new me. The date of the uncommon has come to its end. Truth has been said, judgment has been served. The uncommon ends now! Ah! What the? What happened? Looks like it's over. Who hit me? What are you doing with Mary? Oh, I'm just watching over her. <clears throat> How you feeling? I feel like I should start swinging the other way now. My lady, I know what you think you the That's a good idea. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> Maybe this is your upper lip that stays. <laughs> Open it! Oh! I'm gonna make the rest of the teeth. Dude, that's the wrong part. That's the wrong part. Like that. <laughs> you stay asleep. You stay asleep. <laughs> Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Percentage. Let's do it again. Let's shoot again. Gary, Gary, put that on. You can show it. Get you on the base. Start springing. Can you tell me when you're stoked to start? Are you ready for tonight? Setting it on fire, and we'll dance until we're done in the dark. My lady, I know what you're thinking when the base starts springing. Can you tell me when you're stoked to start?
it's your name.